Hey everyone, welcome to Alchemy Stars. And guess what? I got all five of them. Um, and I um, just want to explain myself before you guys react to what I said before. And um, the first reason why um, I got all of them is because of luck. I just, you know, I got Joker... Uh, two copies of Joker in one pool. I got uh, uh, Queen and Fox in one pool. The first pool of the banner. Mona, of course, is free. And Violet, I got, uh, I think, on the second or third pool. But I got copies of her. So I got two copies of Violet and two copies of Fox. The one copy of Fox... I got in the box that we have a selector that we can select Fox and Violet. It's actually available in the event. So that is history. So it's, it, I was actually bored. Tried to pull on, on the banner, see if I can get them for collection purposes. And I ended up getting all of them. So, okay. Since I called the collab disappointing, you know what I meant? Um, I still think they're disappointing, but but I want to challenge myself and um, create something out of the collab figurines. I see potential in them, but definitely you cannot you cannot use all five unless you have max break through all of them. Then they're very powerful when you use all of them because they they will be relying on their active skill. What if you cannot rely on your active skill or you cannot rely on the other buffs um, in terms of breakthrough? What do you do? So, okay, I'm going to be making a team that has um, has uh, less breakthrough but is still very, not really very powerful enough, but um, it's, still, it's still going to be fun. And also going to deal a lot of damage as well. So um, next is also want to help those who have pulled for these um, collab uh, units. Because again, what are you going to do with them if you're, if, you know, you're going to pull for them? So might as well help those players out. Um, build a decent team. I'm going to go through each and every one of them. And I'm going to go through who I'm going to use. The teams that I'm going to be build will be in a second video. So I see potential in them. Um, but you need to be selective. You need to max out their level. Their equipment probably can be up to level 6. And they're good. Affinity wise, whatever you can have is also good. So for the teams, more or less I'll be using around 2 or 3 um, majority of the teams that I'll be building will be the core of Joker. Next is Violet because number one, they share the same element. They also share the same banner. And Mona because Mona is free. Um, I'm going to talk about team builds in my next video. But I'm going to be um, um, talking about Joker first. Okay, for Joker, I will take back what I said about him. He is going to be your core. Definitely, he doubles up. Um, he doubles up um, stacks. He is going to be your, you know, he's going to be your main damage dealer eventually, and he's your core. So, um, gonna show you guys where I am at with him. So I got um, one, two. Three copies of him, so I'm I'm I actually got lucky with another with a third copy. So if you're if you got Joker, um, if you could get another copy, probably a second copy, this would be good because this will be um, giving you more damage when you're you know you have him at captain. But if you don't. Well, let's we're gonna be settling for just one copy, and it's not going to prob to be a problem. This is going to be um, giving additional damage, but again, I don't know who is crazy enough to 
max break through this guy. But at this point, um, two copies of him is already good. So this is how my Joker looks. Um, I'm already at the Ascension 3 with him. Equipment-wise, he's at 6. Okay, so for Violet, she is also at Ascension 3. Breakthrough, um, if you don't... If you could get copies of Violet, um, it would be better because of the preemptive strike. She's a 5-star. Um, she's easy to get, especially, again, you have that box, a selector box. Um, you could get the second copy there um, because you need the preemptive strike because some of your, you know, if you're going to use two or three, at least one or two will have preemptive strike so that you could hasten the stacks that you that you put so again i have her at uh, only here so she has preemptive strike um got two copies and she is also at equipment uh, level six so again she's ascension three affinity wise she's only at a one okay so for mona she's at ascension uh, two max the ready i'm just waiting for you know some ascension Resources to move uh, Mona to Ascension three. Breakthrough wise, I'm already full with her. Again, she's a she's the she's the free unit that we'll be getting. So this one will also come in handy because you have max breakthrough Mona. Okay, equipment wise, um, Mona is at uh, still level one. I don't have enough. Oh, I do have enough. So let's try to breakthrough or to upgrade mona at least to level two hopefully i can get oh okay so level two um level three will have to be next so affinity is still one again um all three of the uh, the first three that i mentioned are going to be your core so you have uh, especially joker and violet the rest is interchangeable first option would be mona your second option, if you don't want, if you have the queen, she's also good. Um, my problem with her is um, not ascension, but breakthrough wise. Uh, sh she's only at breakthrough two. If you have her at breakthrough three, then she would be more, you know, more valuable but i can work with the with no preemptive strike for her i will use her for the combo for her um chain combo and also for her equipment skill so she's more important um for those um skills okay not necessary for the active skill the active skill if you don't have her at preemptive stripe again it's okay. You can still use her. I think she's she's a good damage dealer at this point. And the last of the bunch is going to be Fox, of course. So Fox is going to, for me, he is going to be a you know a collection item. Um, I don't plan on using him because I have both Mona and Queen. But if you don't have um, Violet, she can be your. Uh, she no, he can be your um one of your core the problem is he is water so he won't work very well in terms of um chain combo uh unless he is captain again violet and joker are there because of they're of the same element you'll have a hard time with him but if you want to replace uh mona with fox you can do that but i think mona would be better i don't like his um active skill because it's in, on a fixed area although it's it's with it's a large area but again you cannot select where you're gonna um throw your active skill with him it's a surrounding fox himself so i have fox at uh breakthrough two with a preemptive strike so both violet and him have preemptive strike for my team also for Mona, so all three of them have preemptive strike. So, how am, am I going to make them work? At this point, I'm just gonna give you guys a clue. Um, core will be Joker, Violet, and Mona. This is the core. If you don't have Mona, 
if you don't want to use Mona, if and if you have the Queen, you can use. If you don't have Violet, you can use Fox. But again, Violet is better than Fox at this point. So there you go. The three, the trio here, and the rest would be probably converters at this point. But I'll give you different variations of this team. Um, showcasing Joker, Violet, Mona, Joker, Violet, Queen. I'm also thinking about using Joker, Violet, Mona, and Queen in one team, which is, which is, I, I think, good. Um, the problem is just um, Chain Cobo is going to suck. So, uh, more or less, I will have three or two, but I'll have four probably because again. Um, their special ability damage is going to depend on how many uh, P5R are in your team. So that is it, guys. So uh, what are your thoughts? Um, if you need any specific team, team builds that um, you want to let me test out, please put them down in the comment section. Um, your, your core will be definitely be Joker and Violet so that you'll have easier time um making sure that they're effective um but again please put down in the comment section what um what do you need what combinations do you want me to test out so that i could incorporate them in the next video so anyway guys thank you very much for staying this far so that is it i actually went crazy when i when i got all five of them but at this point um i really want them I really want them to work because again what's the use of summoning them if we're gonna we're not going to you know at least invest a little on these collab units so hopefully i'm right this time by trying to invest in them but uh anyway guys see you next time take care stay safe this is the warden and i'm out of here